going on everyone this is the mac roberts back again with another nba 2k21 my player builder video and today we're going to be taking a look at the best dikembe mutombo build now i already did deke on last gen or ps4 xbox one so if you're looking for that video check it out in the title card above so without further ado let's get into the build position is going to be center hand in this doesn't matter jersey number also doesn't matter i just chose 55 because that's the number he wore for his entire career for the body settings, you're going to bring him up to 7'2". For the weight, you're going to bring him down to 250 pounds. That was his actual height and weight. And for the wingspan, he was listed at about a 7'6 wingspan. So that's the wingspan we're going to go with. Body shape doesn't really matter. I'm just going to go with Define. Now for the attributes, you're going to bring your close shot up to a 90. Your driving layup up to a 29. Your driving knuck up to a 40. Your standing knuck up to a 95 and your post control up to an 82 and that's going to give you 15 finishing badges for shooting you're going to bring your mid-range shot up to a 55 and your free throw up to a 71 and you're not going to get any additional shooting badges for playmaking you're going to bring your pass accuracy up to a 45 and you're not going to get any additional playmaking badges but for defense and rebounding, you're going to bring your interior defense up to a 95 and max it out. Bring your perimeter defense up to a 32. Bring your steal up to a 54. Bring your block up to a 95. Bring your offensive rebounding up to a 95. And bring your defensive rebounding up to a 95. And that's going to give you 30 defense and rebounding badges. So 15 finishing and 30 defense and rebounding badges is a total of 45 badges. For your physicals, you're going to bring your speed up to a 58, your acceleration up to a 46, your strength up to a 78, your vertical up to a 65, and you're going to spend the rest on stamina. So at 99 overall, you're going to have a close shot of 94, a 33 driving layup, a 44 driving dunk, a 99 standing dunk, and 86 post control. For your shooting stats, you're going to have a 59 mid-range shot and a 75 free throw. For your playmaking, you're going to have a 49 pass accuracy. And for your defense and rebounding, you're going to have a 99 interior defense, a 36 perimeter defense, a 58 steal, a 99 block, a 99 offensive rebound, and a 99 defensive rebound. Your physicals at 99 overall with the gym rat badge are going to be 66 for speed, 54 for acceleration, 86 for strength, 73 for vertical, and 90 for stamina. For the takeover, you could go with, realistically speaking, either stuff blocks and pain intimidation and any of the rebounding ones. So for me, I'm going to go with stuff blocks and see the future. And the build is complete and you have built a paint beast, shades of Dikembe Mutombo, Hassan Whiteside, and Rudy Gobert. Now for your badges, for your finishing badges, you're going to put back down Punisher on gold, drop stepper on gold. Put back boss on Hall of Fame, rise up on Hall of Fame, and lob city finisher on bronze. And for your defense and rebounding badges, you're going to put box on gold, chase down artist on gold, defensive leader on Hall of Fame, heart crusher on Hall of Fame, intimidator on Hall of Fame, post move lockdown on gold, hot stopper on silver, rebound chaser on gold, and rim protector on Hall of Fame. All right, everyone, this has been the best Dikembe Mutombo build. Make sure you like, share, subscribe. Hit that notification bell icon and join the Penny Face Squad. That'd be greatly appreciated. It helps out the channel overall. And you'll also be kept up with everything we do in the channel, so you don't want to miss any of that. Drop a comment below and let me know what you thought of the build. I'm taking requests, so if you have a build that you want to see me make, let me know in the comment section below, and I'll try to make that build for you. I'm making builds every single day for next gen. Uh, I'm not doing current gen so much anymore, but I'll do it for a quest. So if you have a current gen build that you want to see me make, let me know in the comment section below as well. Just say, hey, I want this build for current gen, and I'll try to make that build up for you. Last but not least, thanks for watching, and I'll catch you in the next one. Peace.